Welcome to Sonia Woman History Podcast. On my podcast is Indira Gandhi. Indira Gandhi was born November 19, 1970 in Alabad, India. She died October 31st, 1984. She was an Indian politician who was the first female prime minister of India, serving for three consecutive terms, 1966 and 77, and a fourth term from 1980 until she was assassinated in 1984. Adira Nauru was the only child of Jahola Nauru, who was one of the chief figures in India's struggle to achieve independence from Britain, who was a top leader of the powerful and long-dominant Indian National Congress, and was the first prime minister in 1947 through 64 of independent India. Her grandfather was one of the pioneers of the independent movement and was a close associate of the Mohanets. She attended for one year at West Beagle State and then a University of Oxford in England. She joined the Congress Party in 1938. In 1942, she married Gandhi died of 1960, a fellow member of the party. The couple had two children, Sanjay and Raji. However, the two parents was in exchange from each other for much of their marriage. Indira's mother had died in the mid-1930s. India, after she often acted as her father hostess for events and accompanying him on his travels. The Congress party came to power when her father took office in 1947. And Gandhi, Gandhi became a member of his working community in 1955. In 1959, she was elected to the largest honorary post of the party president. president. She was made a member of the Rajay Raja Sabha of the upper chambers of the Indian in 1964. That, you, that year, who has succeeded... Nauru, as prime minister, named her minister of information and broadcasting to his government. On Shashri's sudden death in January 1966, Gandhi was named leader of the Congress party and thus also became prime minister in a compromise between the party right and left wings. Her leadership, however, came under contentual challenge from the right wings of the party, led by former Minister Finances Maraji Desai. She won a seat in the 1967 election to the Lok Sabha, lower chamber of the Indian. But the Congress party managed to win only a slim majority of seats in Gahiri. Gahiri has to accept Dasi as Deputy Prime Minister. Tension grew within the party, however, in the 1969, she was expelled from it by Dasi and under and other members of the old guard. Undoubted, Gahiri, joined by a majority of party members, formed a new fraction around her called the New Congress Party in 1971. Lok Sabha election, the New Congress Group won a Sweden, a sweeping electoral victory over a coalition of con- conservative parties. Kahiti su- strongly supported East Pakistan, now Bangladesh, in its Sassanist conflict with Pakistan in the late 1971. An Indian orphan force achieved a swift and decisive victory over Pakistan that led to the creation of Bangladesh. She became the first government leader to recognize the new country. In March 1972, buoyed by the country's success against Pakistan, Gaidi again led her new Congress party group to a landslide victories in a large number of elections to state legis- legislative assemblies shortly afterwards. However, her defeat Socialism Party opponent from the 1971 national election charged that she had violated the election laws in that contest. In June 1975, the High Court of Allahabad ruled against her, which meant that she would be deprived of her seat in the 
parliament and will be required to stay out of politics for six years. She appealed the ruling to the Supreme Court but did not receive a satisfactory response. Taking matters into her own hands, she declared a state of emergency throughout India, imprison her political opponents, and assume emergency power. Many new laws was enacted that limit per- per- personal freedom during that period. She also implemented several unpopular policy, including large-scale sterilization as a form of birth control. Public op- public opposition to Galidi. Gahidi, two years of emergency rule was vehement and widespread after it ended in early 1977. The released political rivals were determined to oust her and the new Congress party from power. With a long postponed national preliminary elections were held later in 1977, she and her party were soundly defeated. We up once she left office. Party took over the reins of government with nearly re- recruited members of Dasi as prime minister. In early 1978, Gahani and her supporters completed the split from the Congress Party by forming the Congress Party, the I signifying Indira. She was briefly in prison October 1997, December 1978 on charges of... Official corruption, despite those setbacks, she won a new seat in the Lok Sabha in November 1978, and her Congress party began to gather strength. Dismissions within the ruling Jahanta party led to the fall of its government in August 1979, when new election for the Lok, Lok, Lok Sabha was held in January 1980. Gahini in Congress were swept back into power in the landslide victory. Her son, Sanjay, who has become her chief political advisor, also won a seat in the Lakul Sabha. All legal cases against Indira as well as against Sanjay was withdrawn. Sanjay Gahini death is an airplane crash in June 1980. Indira's cho- chosen successor from the political leadership of India. After Sanjay just after Sanjay's death, Indira groomed her other son, Raiji, for the leadership of her party. She adhered to the queasy socialist policy of inter- 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 industrial development that has been begun by her father. She established a close relationship with the sovereign union dependent on that country for support in India alone, seeing the conflict with Pakistan. During the early 1980s, Indira Gahini was faced with threats to be the political integrity of India. Several states sought a larger measure of independence from the general government. So she's another great lady. She's the prime minister of India. So that was another great lady. She had to go through all this stuff just to be great in, in her country. And I'd like to thank you for listening to Sonya Podcast. Please give it a five-star review on Speaker Spotify. We listen to the podcast that place here. Please follow me at SON.IA 9795 Instagram, Sonya Center, on Twitter, Facebook, Pinterest. Go to my website, com. Please follow my son's sounds on Instagram, we have Ava Ava on Apple and Spotify. Please follow Miss Carr. She has her own affirmations every morning. Please follow T J V U C L A I N. She has a book called Black Girl in Orange. Please follow King Flex on SoundCloud. Please follow Female Reform. They have a venture store in New York and have a blessed night.